Hi, playing chords on a violin. How's that done? Well, I'll tell you. Um, it's a melodic instrument, of course, not a harmonic instrument, but we can play chords different ways. Let's start off with a double stop. That's two notes together. Not a chord yet, but two notes. Easy to do. Two notes together. But a chord consists of uh, three notes or more. So how we play three notes on a violin? Because of the rounded bridge, we can only play two notes at one time. So we need to uh, put in some tricks. And one of them is called arpeggio. Arpeggio is uh, playing the notes separately after one another. So if I had the G, G major, for instance, that is G, B, and the D. And as you can see, I need two notes of the G chord on one string, the G and the B. So I cannot play them together. Uh, so what I can do is put that B one octave, uh, octave higher, first string on the A string. Now I have the G, the B over there, and the loose D string. And now I can play an arpeggio, like... Arpeggios. So one after each other. But we can sort of do as if we play chords as well. So the G chord. Uh, we can play it um, first the G string. And then both of them. So the G string first. And then the chord. So like that. Like that. Or we can play, um, of course, the first two. And we keep the melody note apart. Um, we can play two, the lowest two, and two, the highest. Like the lowest, and then, like that. So you strike two, the two lower strings, and after that, the higher. Both of them. Like that. But let me add one more trick to it. Don't try this at home. We loosen the screw and we can go fishing. Ah, hey, look what I caught, a frog. <laughs> and now we can do this. This is the best way to play chords on a violin. Joe Venuti came up with that, but once again, don't try that at home. Chords on a violin.